In this video, I'm going to show you guys one of the things that's going under the radar in the world today. The reason you're doing a lot of things that you might find toxic, a bad habit, or just overall counterproductive. And it's affecting how you live your life every day. And it's happening across the world to everybody. And today I'm going to show you what it is and how you can better understand what's happening to you. Dopamine is a type of neurotransmitter your body makes and your nervous system uses it to send messages between nerve cells. That's why it's sometimes called the chemical messenger. Dopamine plays a huge role in how we feel pleasure. Yeah, you heard me right. Dopamine is responsible for allowing you to feel pleasure, satisfaction and motivation. When you feel good that you've achieved something, it's because you have a huge surge of dopamine in your brain. Dopamine is released when your brain is expecting a reward. When you come to associate a certain activity with pleasure, the mere anticipation may be enough to raise your dopamine levels. It could be a certain food, sex, shopping, or just about anything else you enjoy. Wait a minute. Yeah, you heard me right. I said sex. <laughs> Jesus, take the wheel. For example, countless studies have shown that phone activity causes a release of dopamine in your brain, making us feel aroused, motivated, happy. Soon enough, your brain begins to associate cell phone with dopamine. And since your brain naturally craves it, you start to get hits of dopamine and the crave of your phone. Now let's really talk about the elephant in the room, sex. Those warm and fuzzy feelings you feel before, during, and after sex, all dopamine related. When you orgasm, your brain releases a surge of dopamine. During the orgasm, your brain is working overtime to produce a slew of different hormones and neurochemicals, and dopamine is the main culprit. With all that being said, these are all chemical reactions responding to the brain. When the brain determines that something is a reward or deemed to be a good feeling, it gets attached to dopamine. And yes, these could all be good things, but more times than not, these also can be bad things like overeating, toxic people, bad activities. It's extremely hard to reprogram the brain. This is why it's so hard to break away from these negative items. And without understanding of what's happening on a chemical level, most of the time we lean on our own understanding and feel like we're broken, but there's a way back. And it's being aware, intentional, and consistent. We can reprogram our brains with some real effort to change what we see as a reward and what we see as fulfilling a healthy life. It's definitely not a sprint, it's a marathon. And if you wake up every day and be intentional to stay the course because it's easy to fall back into bad habits, understanding dopamine and other chemical reactions that the body goes through really helps us understand and strengthen our minds. With our minds strong, you can truly do anything in this world possible. Once again, this is Tom Swoop with Super Fresh and Super Clean. Don't forget, like, subscribe, turn on the bell notifications so you stay in tune with all new content we release on the channel. Thanks again for watching. Super Fresh and Super Clean. We out.